everyone, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Hindi ko alam kung anong oras na nyo ngayon ito pinapanood, but uh, hopefully this will serve you well. I know it has been a while uh, since I last updated yung, mga web, yung website ko and even yung Facebook channel natin na Stocksilog. And I do apologize. Nagkataon lang din kasi na medyo maraming ginagawa sa, sa office. So, hindi ako nakaka, uh, nakakagawa ng mga uh, ng, ng content. Okay? But uh, I do still make sure that from time to time, alam nyo yan, uh, ino open ko yung yung groups just to make sure na medyo may ano naman tayo meron tayong something to to look forward to every day i know how hectic uh, life can be especially for for most of us na uh, who are still working na hindi naman trading yung ating main source of income or uh ginagawa lang ang trading on the side. Dalo mo yun, yung meron kang uh, okay, yung meron kang, meron kang time, let's say, after a meeting or break time or lunch time, and then you'll just wanted, you just wanted to check kung ano yung nangyayari sa, sa market. And then pag may nakita kang uh, maganda, then push, di ba? So, ayun. Now, uh, today is 11 or November. November 2. So, happy All Souls Day to everyone. I do hope nakabisita na kayo sa inyong mga uh, mga kapamilya. Ako kasi wala eh. Uh, nasa province lahat. So, dito na lang muna. <laughs> okay. So, Uh, let's go with uh, some of um, the things here. So PSE, as we try to see here, uh, I really thought I really thought this week is um, a good week for PSE. But because uh, if you can see here, uh, so let's start tayo ng this one from October 21, Tama. and as you can see from October 31, it already grew. So, October 21. So, start hanggang dito. So, more or less 1.29%. Okay. Now, uh, I was really hoping that we can uh, get over the 8,000 mark. 8,000 points mark. Pero wala eh. Mukhang hindi kinaya. Uh, to be honest, hindi ako nakapag mm, naka-check nung mga nangyayari over the market this uh, this week. So, uh, we'll just see how it goes. Diba? Now, uh, let's see in terms of of the trends. Uh, actually, meron akong kasi yung chart ko dito. Uh, this one. Uh, I think meron ako nagawa dito for PSE before. See, ah, wala pa. Wala pa. Okay. Okay, anyways, sige. Uh, I'll just uh, make a quick plot. This one, and... This one. Ayan, okay. So, as you can see, nasa kalagitnaan ng PSE right now, ng plot natin, which is quite big, ha, to be honest. Uh, this is 6,800. Let's try to plot a more, clo a closer one. So, this up until here. So, ayan. Uh, uh, smaller range, 7,4 up to 8,3. No. So, ayan. Uh, I can see here, uh, sideways pa rin siya as we go to the next following weeks leading to the to the end of the year okay now let's see uh, as you can see here and dito yung mga hindi may naalagaan but uh, these are just my watch list dito ko na kung saan na sila ano nangyayari whenever i see something interesting na may potential 
then I just add them to the wish list and then on a day to day basis I just go to them. So let's see uh, how they are. So first one is Annie. Oh wow, okay. So Annie uh well, uh it broke down sa, sa support niya noong twenty four. I don't let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh yeah, uh, by the way, uh when I go uh my number one source of information actually is Twitter. <laughs> so uh I just try to look at what's happening. Um so sorry. So this is si Annie, no? Uh meron bang news kay Annie lately? Uh so siguro uh a handy trick. Uh I have some people I do follow already. Uh these are the people or accounts na talagang stock specific. So what I can do is just search here and then people I follow. That way, I can see kung ano nangyayari. So, yung mga, uh, yung mga, hindi mga mga reports. But, uh, every mention of the word, of my keyword, yun, alam na siya. Hmm, kailan yung 24, di ba? October 24. Let's see. Hmm, well, sabi ni DA Market, uh, foreign fund sold Ani. Who else? Oh, yun lang. Ani. Ayun. Um, Confirm subsidiary, the Big Chill Inc. is finalizing its intended listing in PSE. Unnamed sources claim the issue size might be upsized from 600 million to 1 billion with its diversification into vegetarian food retailing and roller cashless vending machines for beverage lines. But no, October 17 pa to eh. So, which is. Which. Uh, sorry, the plan ito. 17 is Wednesday and then nag broke uh, nag nag break down siya ng 24. But oh, I can't find anything specific ha, to be honest. Oh well, oh well, that life. Minsan talaga, minsan you can see it, minsan naman wala. Uh, what can you do? <laughs> so, ayun. Um now what I usually do here since na bro na na break na tong support na to then I make the adjustment I just move it here basically oh, look at this one so it does still is a, a major support kasi kung mapapansin natin dito itong itong let's see here itong part na to di ba uh, malalaki ko ba siya wala kasi akong mouse eh. so touchpad lang kami ito talaga ngayon so I may hear up but uh but anyway sige uh this line yung 1258 or uh, 1258 to 1260 was a, a resistance before noong 2017 for ani and it at the same time it also served as a support noong feb 2018 and now on ang maganda naman sa kanya is that bounce back naman siya from the the 12.8, the 12.60 line. Ngayon, it's at th uh, 13.38. Uh, is it already a bounce? I would say so. Yes, it is already a bounce. It, it was also already confirmed uh, from the nung 24, di ba? So, 25 yep uh no, I think it is 25. Yeah, 25 pala. Sorry guys. So, so 25. No, 25. Uh, Doon na nag-break uh, down. And then, nag-rebound na siya from there. Uh, so yeah, this is this one is very critical, 1280. Otherwise, medyo tingin ko malaki pa yung bawa-baba na ito kung sakali. Kasi, if you can see here, we could potentially see the uh, the price of Ani go, go back to around what? mga around 1210 sorry around 10 1050 imagine that Ar around 20 percent uh, pa so once again i like uh, how it went nag rebound na siya agad from the 1258 uh, and that is a good uh, uh good start okay let me just uh, save this one 
Next. Chelsea. Okay. So, I drew this line before kasi sabi ko mukhang maganda yung potential letter for bounce. Unfortunately, if you can see here, na-break niya yung support. So, that means this trend line is already invalid. I just need to move this one. Na. Maybe here. Yeah. Potentially. Pero kasi syempre, uh, hindi pa siya nag-bounce eh. Uh, I, wo I won't the uh, uh, I won't commit to this one yet. Next, DD. DD is something that is that I've been eyeing uh, lately. Simply, uh, simply because uh, yung support line is very, I would say stable and strong. Kasi kung mapansin natin dito, etong part na to. Muntik na siya bumaba but nakabangon siya. Uh, the, the not so good thing lang about, uh, about this one is it is still kissing the support line. Okay? So, with this one, what I will, uh, what I'll do is I'll just wait it out. Hintayin ko yung rebound niya. Kasi, uh, it could go either way, uh, up or down. And, kung mabansin nyo yung, yung yung volume niya is very very little so with a confirmed bounce and with a really good volume magandang abangan to si Didi green I had green before uh, dito nakabili ko dito banta rito hanggang sumabot siya dito uh, nakapagbenta na ako dito Pero meron pa ako kasi natitira. That's why I still wait kung ano mangyayari sa kanya. Uh, I really thought it will go to the... Kung mapapansin nyo, this is a double top uh, pattern. Kaso wala eh. Nabreak na niya agad yung neck niya. ba So, yeah. Uh, the reason why it's still here is because may hawak pa ako. And uh, I would wait it out. Siguro up to, yeah. Pag nabreak itong current level niya na 220. Let's say pag nabreak yung 225. Then I, I will uh, sell it out now. But for now, hmm, stick around since wala pa naman ako nakikita ng major, uh, major decline. Next is ICT. Yes! So, ICT made a reverse, uh, a bounce, uh, a bounce last October 9th. Yun nga lang, medyo mabigat din yung ano. Kasi as you can see, nag-rebound na siya, di ba? Yun nga lang, nahihilis siya pababa. Kahapon lang, actually. Wow. Why? Uh, ICT. Foreign sold. Foreign sold. Oh, meron na inauguration ng port sa... UMM, QASR, si Iraq. Hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, sabi ni DA, uh, 1.15 support, dahil 1.15 support, yeah. Actually, parehas kami ng ano, ng, uh, nang nakikita ni, uh, ni DA. Yeah, 1.15 is really the critical support level for, uh, for ICT. Well, uh, wala pa akong hawak ng ICT. But the recent decline, I I am already thinking. Potentially, potentially, uh, I could go. Yung nga lang kasi, uh, ay, actually, hindi pa pala. Kasi, another thing that I can see here is yung uh, lower lows niya. Low, sorry, lower highs, which is not good to be honest. Lower highs is this is the previous high, the next high is lower than the previous high, and then ito na naman, uh, repeating the same pattern. So, uh, uh, let's see, let's see. Ako, I would, um, yeah, here, etong line na to, I, I need this one to break before I can. 
I can try it out. Primex. This one is also one of my uh, my my watch list. Kasi, kung mapasin nyo, yung, yung DOS. DOS is very critical. Ang hirap niyang, eh, ano, uh, hindi pa nababasag si DOS since, kaya ba ito? May. Almost, what, six, six months? Na hindi pa nababasag. And, uh, that type of consolidation, once it breaks out, I really thought before mag-break out na siya dito, but, well, bumabagad eh. So, ayun. Uh, I actually bought the Primex to not break out siya dito. Dito, itong part na to. Kaso, the next day kasi bumaba na siya. So, uh, I had to cut my losses there. So, hopefully, once uh, mag-confirm uh, ulit yung bounce niya, break out, then I will definitely, definitely buy. Next, uh, Vita. Okay. I really like Vita. Uh, si, uh, technical wise dahil uh, magandang consolidation na dito. So, I'm just waiting for the 1.41 to break. 1.40 level to break. Um, kasi naka, ano pa kasi naman natin na uh, patas na rin naman siya. And the volume is relatively okay. So, let's just wait, with, wait for it. Uh, next is Wilcon. Yeah. With Wilcon kasi, yeah, konso pa to sa, sa top. But who knows, ha? Huh? Ito, what's ang 1742 ay na-break? Tingin ko, mataas na naman yung potential nito. So, yeah, um, yun lang ang nasa wishlist list ko. Wish list tuloy, uh, watch list pala, I mean, wish list. Kasi, uh, I was, I was just, uh, looking at the, ano eh, yung wish list part ko dahil dun sa Chris Kringle namin, or sa Secret Santa, sa, sa office. <laughs> so, that's why I was, uh, uh, mentioning, uh, wish list instead of uh, watch list. So ayun, um, I know guys that this is my first uh, first attempt to uh, to post a video sa YouTube channel ko. Uh, sa YouTube channel ni, ni Stocksilog. So, uh, I plan to do similar uh, videos in the future. So, I do hope you uh, you support uh, Stocksilog YouTube channel. That is it. Thank you guys for uh, for watching and have a great day. Bye.